I heard that Mr. President sent Emir Fili out of his office and gave him 72 hours to resign. Do Ibuqui, welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. A few hours ago, a former spokesperson of the Progressive Congress APC Lagos State Chapter, Joe Ibuqui, took to his social media page and revealed what he heard about Godwin Emufili and his quest to become the next president of Nigeria. It may trust you to know that the governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, Godwin Emufili, has said to have declared his interest to run for the 2023 presidential election. However, the special advisor to Governor Sanwolu on drainage and water resources, Joe Ibuki, revealed that a governor was allegedly sent out of Paris office and he was given 72 hours to resign if he wants to contest the 2023 presidential election. According to Iwokwe, he said, I heard that Mr. President sent Emir Fili out of his office and gave him 72 hours to resign. In my opinion, the president has the right to send any Nigerian politicians out of his office, most especially the ones who want to contest for the presidency but are not ready to resign from their political appointment. What is your take on this very issue? Hmm. Sincerely, sincerely, let me let me even ask this. First of all, Mr. Godwin, I'm tempted to say, is that I'm tempted? Greediness is not good, Dusha. Sincerely, greediness is not good. The people who want to contest for the presidency or who have declared their interest, you know, who have come out and said, oh, they're interested in running for presidency. The president has asked them, you choose between the two, and you have until 16th May to resign. Now, I heard in the news yesterday or two days ago, I think 48 hours ago, that Godwin Emir Fili actually went to court and the court told INEC to allow him to contest while still be the governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria. And I'm asking myself, is there a neck that told people to resign? It is the president who has exclusive powers on this particular issue that came out and told people, look, if you know you want to contest for the presidency and you're in any ministerial position or any position at all, any political appointment you, you have or with you or you are serving under anywhere, that is, you know, it's, it, it was appointed to you, you have to resign. I'm seeing it as Amy Philly being too greedy. He even went as far as going to went as far as going to um you know the court to tell them and they now give him whatever order to give to INEC and all of that and I'm asking myself there is no need for all this it is the president that actually asks people to sign and not even um INEC. So coming out to say that this happened is something I don't understand. Yes. Coming out to come out and give I neck and, and uh, whatever is not, is what I don't understand. Joy, but what have you said about the killing in Sokoto school? You and your boss kept me because of the presidential ambition, but you're quick to hear and to announce that your brother Emifili was set out of the office by Mr. President. Maybe we should leave my alone. Hmm. You want to eat his cake and still have it. That's the kind of leaders we have all around. It's not peculiar to him alone. Okay. You are suffering from acute iberiberism. What a shame. We should leave me alone. Hmm. The full of a century. This man is daydreaming and is a joker. Emir Fili is, is a thief. Let's remind him that position is not forever. He still have the mission of stolen Nigeria. He still have the mission of stolen Nigeria to make up <laughs> to make up campaign. <laughs> we should leave me alone. Joy Boko, your children killed the innocent lady for nothing. I'm still waiting to hear your voice. <laughs> okay. Okay. 
Jebukwe, your children, okay, okay. They're not man enough. They're afraid of losing their present juicy post. Bunch of <laughs> sincerely, it is only greediness that will make a man have you have food in your house and you still don't want to share the food you have in your house with others, even when you know that it's possible that you're going to get a better one. You're the one that actually ask. You're the one that asks, you know, for this. Nobody is putting a gun in your head and saying you must be the president of Nigeria. Propaganda. Your lies will never stop. Lie, Mohammed, brother. <laughs> Have you two had someone that was killed in Sokoto State? And why are you not saying anything or you're waiting when it will be in the South just before you open your mouth? My brother... On Joy Bokwe's matter, we don't know what is wrong with him. On this Sokoto's issue that almost everyone come, almost, uh, how am I going to put it now? On this issue, many people are coming now to attack Joy Bokwe, saying on the issue on ground that he does not come out to, you know, speak on issues that are supposed to be spoken on. He always speaks, and this thing is getting a lot of people. Well, that is not even the issue. The issue on ground is that um, Emir Philly, he's being greedy and it is only, I see it as normal, even in life, you don't get to a certain position without giving up. You are not certainly doing well if you are never doing well. <laughs> like you cannot be, let's say for instance, let me just use a poor man and you remain the poor man that you're rich. It's not possible. You have to give up a certain, like what you have. It's a give and take situation. Okay. This man is seriously looking for news. He's based on every information rumor to get news from people which he capital capitalizes to form uh, news. He wants to still eat his cake and have it. This is the kind of videos we have all around. Sincerely, he wants to eat his cake and have it because, like I said earlier before, it is only normal, it's only natural that he wants something better 